Hello, my lovely students. Today, I'm going to give you a brief description about our first unit in the book, which is about using positive rational numbers. In this unit, we will be learning about how to add, subtract, multiply, and divide decimals. We will also learn how to estimate with decimals and use estimation to check our answers and to see if they are reasonable. We will also learn how to multiply, divide fractions and mixed numbers, and we will use models as such as bar diagrams and number lines, and we will use patterns to multiply and divide, subtract and add. We will use compatible numbers to estimate quotients, and we will solve multiple step problems with rational numbers. So these are the skills and concepts that we are going to cover throughout this unit. The key concept is going to be logic. The related uh, concept is quantity and simplification. The global context is scientific and technolog techno uh, technical innovation. The statement of inquiry gives our big idea. Logic is a powerful tool to simplify quantities using specific methods to present creativity in different contexts. This is our assessment objectives. We are going to have criterion A, which is about knowing and understanding. We will select appropriate mathematic, uh, mathematics when solving problems in both familiar and unfamiliar situations. We will apply the selected mathemat mathematics successfully when solving problems. We will solve problems correctly in a variety of contexts. And we have also criterion B, which is about applying mathematics in real-life contexts. We will identify relevant elements of authentic real-life situations, select appropriate mathematical strategies when solving authentic real-life situations. We will apply the selected mathematical uh, strategies successfully to reach a solution. We will apply the selected mathematical strategies uh, to, to reach a solution. We will explain the degree of accuracy of a uh, solution, and we will explain whether the uh, solution makes sense in the context in the context of the authentic real life situation. This is our integration part. We are going to integrate math and science. We will uh, learn how to uh, find speed and uh, velocity. When calculating a speed or a velocity which involve the distance traveled divided by the time taken, positive rational numbers are frequently used. For example, if an object travels 150 meters in 30 seconds, the speed is calculated as 150 divided by 30, which is 5 meters. Of course, we will learn more about this uh, during the unit, and we'll have uh, extra activities about uh, how to integrate math and science. Also, we'll be integrating math and technology. Uh, measurements are essential for uh, uh, physics quantities such as length, time, mass, and temperature. These measures, measurements are often expressed as positive rational numbers with appropriate units. This is an example for that, and of course, we'll be, we'll be working online using different types of online tools and websites, and this is how we integrate math and technology. This is our unit project. Our unit is going to be, the unit part is going to be thinking like an engineer. Take a walk around the inside and the outside of your school building. Make a list of specific things or areas that need improvement. Then choose one idea and do some background research to gain an understanding of factors that might impact improvement efforts. The problem, how can you calculate the area for rooms of different shapes? To solve this problem, perform the activities that are going to be in the BC page, in your unit page. And your project is going to be creating a PowerPoint presentation about area calculations of, and how can you calculate area of different shapes. We will be talking about the unit project uh, uh, during the uh, uh, viewing the BC page, the uh, unit page, and you'll be finding uh, tutorials about your unit project with the rubric as well. Unit reflection and in alignment with math vision and vision. 
use the knowledge of mathematics, methodology, and context explanation based on a valid and reliable evidence obtained for, from a variety of resources to describe and solve word problems and help with the international community. Mathematics development is uh, evidence of the need of international collaboration. Understanding mathematics methodology helps us uh, to analyze major global challenge to specify quantities and quantitative criteria and uh, for solutions that account for social needs and wants.